Déjate adelantar, déjate adelantar. De que te dejen pasar. Es que es inglés, no te entiendo. Bueno, bueno. Bandera amarilla, eh. Ya lo sé, ya lo sé. Sí, por eso, por eso. Ya está, ya está, tranquilo, tranquilo. Admins, I don't know what the fuck do I do. I don't know what the uh, rules. Because you have passed through her when there was... Uh, what do you, you do? Stop? Up. Welcome to the Zen Zone. Zen Lee here with Psychotherapeutico. We are getting geared up and warmed up for our semi-final race in Group A. We are both on Team One Ride. This is Team One Ride's first time racing in a championship or any race in fact it's my first time racing in a championship race this is the x electric championship a series of five races spread across spain and this is the first in the series circuit venaros i'd like to start off with a big shout out to my sponsor one ride for making this all happen and sponsoring me with the links and psycho with the links we would not be able to compete at such a high level if it wasn't for one ride Check out oneride.eu and use discount code ZENZONE to get yourself 5% off anything that is not on sale in the store. Both Psycho and I rocking the Leaper Kim links, the best wheel ever made. The only difference between our two wheels is that mine has the 50S cells with an asphalt tire. This has the 50E cells with a knobby tire. But here goes Psycho into the first place pole position. This means he had the fastest time out of any monocycle in the time trial so he is awarded the first pole position me in the third pole position at the fifth fastest time there are two groups here this is group a group b will be racing after us group a right now getting ready cycle in the first place pole position steven in the second pole position zen lee in third julio in fourth shakal in fifth we are about to get into the action shout out to all the racers participating in this event we are making history and we are off only the top five racers in this event will move on to the finals the top five from each group moving on cycle in the front you can see how he likes to use his hand my cam right there I'm in the white armor, the white Liat armor. Psycho in the first place position right here though, makes a mistake, a big mistake early on in the race. Maybe some nerves. Steven quickly passes him. Zen Lee as well. Julio passes. There are three people in front of Psycho. This is Julio's cam right now. He has two people in front of him. Psycho in fourth place position. That was a big mistake early. Steven takes a huge lead. Zen Lee in second place. Julio in third. Psycho in fourth. He's having some issues, man. That was a huge mistake early on in the race. This is the hardest corner of the race in my opinion because you have to break really hard. Psycho able to get his third place position back from Julio. Julio dropping to fourth place. Zen still in second. Steven has a huge lead in the first place. Psycho making his move on Zen Lee right here. Able to come up, cut him off, takes the turn. Clean turn. Psycho back in second place position. Now Steven still way in the lead. Zen Lee in third. This is the end of the first lap. We're moving on to the second lap here. Psycho makes another mistake, comes a bit too wide. Zen Lee almost able to get his second place position back. He is fighting Psycho for that second place position. Julio in fourth. He is right on Zen Lee's butt, looking for any mistake, any opportunity to move past. Steven still well in the front. Psycho can barely see him he's just a little speck psycho coming around this turn using his unique style with the gloves zen lee third place julio in fourth psycho second place psycho getting a little bit closer to steven this is the final turn of lap two psycho hands on the ground and his tire slips out from under him zen lee goes by tells him to get up julio third place zen in second that's a great opportunity right there everyone passing psycho psycho in frustration throws up his hands we are moving on to lap three seven more laps to go julio still on zen six not giving him any space really trying to crowd him and pressure him off the line psycho picking up his wheel trying to get it back together and he drops it again and his puck falls off his glove things are not going well for psycho his wheel's not balancing there he goes he's getting on it he picks up his puck and still trying to get things together. Zen Lee, meanwhile, trying to catch up to Steven. Zen Lee in second place position, Steven in first. Steven just a speck on Zen Lee's camera though. Psycho is back on his wheel, trying to finish lap number two. He is in ninth place position, and there he goes, moving into lap number three in eighth position. Seventh position, now he's working his way up to sixth position. He is in sixth position, but sixth position is not enough to move on to the finals. He needs to get at least to number five, or he will not be moving on to the finals. 
but if anybody can do it, it's Psycho. He had the fastest time in the time trials by a significant margin over Liania, 0.2 seconds faster than Liania, who is the leader of the next group in the semifinals that will be coming up next. Psycho goes around this curve and eats the pavement again. The asphalt, his new home, his new amigo. He is spending more asphalt, more time on the asphalt than he is in riding. He's on tilt, man. I feel his frustration. He didn't slip in practice at all, and now already in this race, he slipped three times and made a major mistake. But he gets back up on his wheel and pushes through. He has a long ways to go. This is only lap three. He's been down three times. His body's probably aching a little bit, but he still pushes on, moving on to lap four. He has to pass about five people now to get to the finals. Coming up, there's lap four, Psycho crossing the lap four line. You can see Steven and myself about to lap cycle. Here we come around the corner. This is lap number five for Steven and myself. Steven, I am slowly closing the distance on Steven. Back to Psycho's cam. He says, ta luego to Christina, and she says, ta luego back to him. That's see you later in Spanish, because Psycho is taking off. Hopefully he's starting to find his flow because he's got to pass many, many people if he's going to move on to the final. And he passes Ricardo right there, but he needs to pass about three more if he's going to move on to the finals. Looks like he's starting to get his groove, making the turns a little bit cleaner. Not quite sure what happened. His knobby tire just not sticking well. Meanwhile, Steven and I battling it out. Steven has seven podiums and I have seven podiums. We are tied for the most podiums in the world. His are higher. I am closing the distance. This is my nemesis right here, Steven, and I am closing the distance. I know he's getting tired. There was the flag right there. If you guys noticed, the flag was not waving. There's some huge drama coming up right here. Pay attention. See if you can see any yellow flags waving, seeing if this pass was not the cleanest pass of the race. Here I come. Steven's getting tired. I boosted out with my 50 SLs. I don't see any flags. I don't see buddy, anybody on on the track it is a clean open track nobody's on it that was a clean pass on steven yet here i come around the corner of lap six and they're gonna try to this guy here he's trying to tell me the commissioner the commissioner is trying to tell me pull over and let steven pass pull over and let steven pass but i am not pulling over i didn't even hear the guy i am in the zen zone and that was a clean pass there is nobody on the track nobody crashed there was no reason for a yellow flag on my side of the track maybe somebody crashed on this side of the track but i do not see him at this moment it is a clean track and i am in first place and i am running with this lead trying to break away from steven but steven is not giving up he is pushing he does not want to give up that first place position i am now starting to lap people i love being in the first place position is so awesome i don't feel any pressure at all when i'm in the first place position but i have made mistakes in the first place position before sometimes the pressure does get to you when you are in the lead you can feel the pressure especially if someone like steven is on your rear here again they're trying to get me to pull over and let steven pass me i am not pulling over i did not even see that guy i don't even care i don't even know what he was saying i did not do anything that was dangerous but man they are not liking the fact that i passed steven i'm not sure why because there are no yellow flags guys this nobody has even crashed have you guys seen anybody crashed in my lane that i had to dodge or avoid that's what the yellow flags are for back to psycho psycho is finding his groove he is on lap number seven three more laps to go exhaustion probably from his crashes and from the unexpected slips has him probably like second guessing himself mentally he's just not doing very well physically he looks good he's looking strong he's still staying ahead of steven and myself you see steven and myself coming on to lap number nine right here psycho just barely in front of us steven and i catching up steven pulls over to the side he is exhausted guys the exhaustion sets in for steven and i really start to break away i am on lap number nine but i don't know how many more laps to go i'm actually going to be yelling out oh there's a yellow flag and somebody off the track so after the race you're going to see the drama with the yellow flag that's the yellow flag i thought everyone was talking about i thought that was the reason i was being penalized was for that moment like i'm going to be like was i supposed to stop what was i supposed to do the guy was off the track that was the yellow flag that's the only yellow flag i saw the entire race and so that's the one i thought i was being penalized for here i am about to lap christina we are on lap number nine still we have two more laps to go i am exhausted steven is way behind me though i have created a huge gap and i'm just like trying to figure out how much energy i need to use because the finals are coming up i know i'm making the finals i don't want to push too hard and use up all my energy there's no reason for that i'm on my final lap but i don't know that 
I take it a little bit easier around these turns, not wanting to make any mistakes. I am so far ahead of Steven. I'm at least five seconds to 10 seconds ahead of Steven. And that gap is increasing as I'm pushing on because he has reached a point where he is so exhausted. He knows he's getting second place position. Nobody's really challenging Steven. Here I am on the final lap, but I don't know that I'm a bit frustrated. I'm like, how many more laps do I have to do? Oh man, I remember the exhaustion and the finals is coming up. The finals is 12 laps, so I have to be ready for 12 laps. 12 laps coming up right after this. Get about two hours of rest and then we move on to the finals. There it is, there's the finish. First place in the semifinals, Zen Lee, first place. Still, Steven has not finished. I don't even know, I was at least five seconds ahead. Back to Cycle, he's on his final lap. He's about to pass Peke here. I'm not quite sure what place he is in, but he has to pass a few more people probably to get into the finals. We won't know until the next video if he made the finals or not. So stay tuned for that. If you guys enjoyed this race, please like, comment, share, help grow the race scene. I've been trying to grow the race scene since Apple Valley won. I was one of five racers to help start growing the racing scene. I've gotten millions of views on my videos. I'm trying to really promote it and hopefully we can get to the big leagues one day. The X Electric Championship is our path to the big leagues. If you want to stay tuned for some drama, I'm going to leave the natural sounds on. Thank you to one red. All right, so here, the red flag is pulled on me and he is penalizing me. I had no idea that red flag was for me. I thought he was asking me uh, what position I was. He asked me what number I was. I said number one because I thought that's what he was asking me. But he was trying to get my bin number so that he could penalize me. You're a Well done, but it's strange. He said you were passing off with a yellow flag. So maybe you have a penalty, I'm not sure. There is something strange. Yeah. Whatever. I got number one. No, no doubt in my mind. You did a great good. Yeah. Yeah. I don't understand this rule. Yeah. 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 You are the best. They give you five or ten seconds penalty, but I think you have enough advance. I don't know. What the fuck do I do? I don't know what the rule is. Because rules. you have passed over when there was a. What do you do? Flag. Stop? You can't, you can't pass over the one in front when he's a yellow flag. You can only go for the one who are late. Then you can pass them. So maybe, but I know, I, I heard that they give you a penalty. But, but the other guy said to the other, the second, to the so maybe you have enough advance. So, so I got a penalty or what? Hmm? They're saying I got a penalty. Why? Something. Because they said, the commissaire said, he passed over uh, during a yellow flag. But worse, you are so bad. I passed during a yellow flag? I don't know what the fuck you're supposed to do. Stop? Okay. Oh, yellow flag. Yellow flag means there is something on the piece, on the circuit, on the tracks, there is a problem, so you cannot pass direct competitor. If someone is late, of course you pass over. But if you are in direct competition, you don't. Oh, I got a nice video. So. Yeah, yeah, I, I, got and, nice video. I don't care about the stupid rule. Yeah, and sorry if I give you a bad. Uh, <laughs> worst case, you are so bad, and then you have the final. So, I don't know. Okay. Here they're saying I got a penalty, though. So. Yeah. So I got a penalty? Yes. I don't understand the rule. Because when you uh, pass Steven, there's some uh, man in the floor because he fall and uh, was a yellow uh, flag. Oh. Yes. It's a clean pass. So what's the penalty? It's really... I beat Steven by like 15 seconds. No, no, no more. I think it's 10 seconds. I don't know. I don't know. I got it on video. The video is going to tell the truth. I, 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 I do because there must be more uh, people with, with luck. Because if you are riding fast, you are not looking at any time the, the flags. I can barely move my head. Huh? Yeah, I got a penalty, but I don't know if it's... I should... If they don't give me first place, it's fucking bullshit. It was a clean pass. Mm. But they must uh, something say a red flag. Uh, yeah, they had a yellow flag. Yellow flag. Sorry, boss. No, no, no. No, no, no. No, My body good, my mind destroyed. Yeah. You know, I was doing well. I don't, yeah. I don't know, I didn't sleep. So I didn't slide in all the fucking trainings. I didn't slide in the chronos. 
and hit it, I slide three times. Yeah. I don't know if maybe my, my was so hot, you know, or... Maybe, maybe also the ground became hotter and it was slippery because of your tire. Maybe, I don't know. But for the next time, uh, you have yeah. to... Yeah, but I, I'm, I'm, I'm still in the final or not? I don't know. This is the question. I, w I will see, because yeah, if I'm in the final... You, if you are in the final, you have a chance, but if you don't yeah. have to the final, next time. Fuck. Qué mierda, tío. Vamos, va. Se me ha ido la rueda tres veces, bro. Tío, ¿qué te ahí dos minutos y tú sin el chiriquiqui y este ganas a todo el mundo? ¿Qué haces recogiendo esa mierda dos minutos? Fuck, bro. Three times I fell. Did you make a final stop? I don't know. Did you pass five people? Yeah. I will see you, bro. Puta madre. Oh,